What is up, my captain's crew? How are you all doing? That was a very different intro, wasn't it? That's not how I normally do things. <laughs> I'm guessing we're mixing things up today. I'm guessing that's how it's going to go. But how are you all doing? How is work? How is school? How is life? <laughs> I genuinely want to know. You guys are always, uh, you're always saying such nice things to me. You're always wishing me well. How is things with you? How is your life? I hope things are really good. If they're not, the internet's a big place. I'm sure you can find something to make you laugh around it somewhere. You might have to dig for it. There's a lot of negativity and a lot of hate on the internet these days. Well, it's kind of always been on the internet, really. But I think if you dig for it, I think if you look hard enough, you're sure to find some comedic gold, some nuggets of comedic gold there somewhere to make you smile. And if in doubt, you can just watch more of my videos. My God, a shameless plug. But <laughs> yeah. The point of this video, sorry, I got sidetracked there at the start. Um, the point of this video, uh, it's been a while since I've done one of these, just sitting here, sort of opening up a bit of a dialogue with you guys outside of my um, my normal walkthrough video. So, there's a couple of things I want to discuss, mainly just stuff to do with walkthroughs, there's a couple of scheduling stuff, and some newer stuff that's going to be coming to the channel. Don't worry, nothing is getting scrapped. I know normally with updates, videos, it's a, uh, a bit of a worry that there's going to be a delay in videos. Not the case. Spider Man, days gone. Still continuing forwards. There's just a, uh, a few changes and a few things I just wanted to. Um, let you guys know about and just generally have a bit of a chat. So, with that being said, first thing was in my Q&A live stream. I mentioned about wanting to live stream Ultima Alliance 1, Ultima Alliance 2. Um, obviously, you've noticed that hasn't happened. Uh, I've been having a few issues with my PS3. It's not actually uh, an issue with my PS3 per se. It's more to do with Sony and uh, copyright protection. Uh, with newer pieces of uh, recording software, uh, it basically uh, Sony blocks... Uh, the ability to capture uh, gameplay or DVD content or anything like that. On the PS4, you can turn it off, so you can still record gameplay, but you can't record DVDs or Blu-rays. Uh, on the PS3, it just blocks everything outright, and there's no option to be able to turn off that um, that feature. I thought I found a workaround, and I'm pretty certain I have found a workaround. I just, unfortunately, I can't afford it. And by the time it gets to the point where I will be able to afford it, we'll be so close to the release of Ultimate Alliance 3. There is just no time to be able to get through uh, number one and number two by the time number three comes out. So, unfortunately, for that reason, I won't be live streaming Ultimate Alliance 1 and Ultimate Alliance 2, which sucks because I really was looking forward to that. I haven't played the, those games for quite a while, and I was especially Ultimate Alliance 1. I haven't played that in years. And I was really looking forward to live streaming that. I thought that'd be a lot of fun before number three comes out. But, however. That being said, I'm still adamant I want to live stream something. So what I'm actually going to be doing is I'm going to be live streaming Days Gone. Now, there's many reasons for this. The reasons I'm not going to bother getting into is this is going to end up turning into like a 20 minute long ramble video. But the main reason is that a lot of you guys have told me this is a very long game. And the way I'm uploading it right now, it is going to take forever for us to make any headway into this game. Especially seeing how right now I only have time roughly to record like once a week, twice if I'm lucky. It's going to take forever to get through this game. So I figured live streaming it, it would be a lot more fun. We could have a big, long, one-hour, two-hour-long live stream to really make some headway on the game. All the while, interacting with you. Um, Days Gone is very much a game kind of like Skyrim in the sense that you can upload a 30-minute, 40-minute video and not really much takes place in that time because it's such a big game. A lot of things you do take quite a while to do unless you, you just go absolute crazy and just run in. Which, to be honest, would suit the character of Deacon St. John. He is, without a doubt, one of the craziest characters I've ever played in the game. Bearing in mind, I've done a Deadpool walkthrough. Deacon St. John, crazier. Like, Deadpool's funny, insane crazy. Deacon St. John is just cross the street to get away from him, back, a lot, back away slowly kind of crazy. He is just a complete nutter butter. Like, Looney Tunes crazy. But, um... That being said, um, it takes a lot of time to get some stuff done in Days Gone. So in each episode, not much is really happening. So I figured if I live stream, I could be interacting with you guys. Uh, you could be telling me stuff I've missed. Maybe stuff that I need to be looking out for. Because I do notice I miss a lot of stuff in Days Gone. Because I'm focusing on so many things at one time. Um, so it'd be great to be able to have an interaction with you lot like that. And also, we, um, each session of Days Gone. Uh, Days Gone, apparently I'm Sean Connery again. Looks like that's how the rest of this video is going. In the days gone live stream. <laughs> Imagine if I kept that voice up the whole um, the whole video. But yeah, each video would be like an hour, two hours, maybe two and a half hour, three hour videos, and we'd get a lot done in that space of time. Um, if you don't, if you're unable to catch the live stream, by the way, don't worry, you're not going to miss it. Um, the live streams are still available on my channel, and if they're not, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to record the gameplay while live streaming it and upload it as a separate video. So the plan going forward is to let all the stuff I've already got for days gone. Uh, to finish uploading to YouTube, and when YouTube catches up to where I currently am in the game, then I'm going to start live streaming. And um, 
it will just continue on the walkthrough like that. So we'll have part 11, 12, 13, however many episodes I've got left. And then as soon as we run out of content, part 14 will just be part 14 like normal, but it'll be two hours instead of 20 minutes. And then the next part will be part 15, and that will be two hours. So the walkthrough will still continue. It's just it will basically go in from half hour episodes to like two hour long episodes and you can just catch up and watch through um, at your discretion so the only downside of that may, would mean instead of getting uh, videos every other day with days gone we'll have one big long episode probably like once a week or something like that but um i just feel like it's a game that will work better live streaming I, I just i feel like it is instead of being these uh every other day episodic games as i feel like days gone can be on the channel for as long as say skyrim has been um with that being said, there's going to be no scheduling for the live stream. I, I'm not going to say every Sunday at 6 p.m. tune in. It's just going to be um, it's going to be as and when. Um, I'm going to aim for at least once a week if I can. I can't guarantee that. Um, there's going to be a lot of changing around. There's going to be a lot of figuring this out because I've never live streamed a game before. Um, as I say, I'm going to aim for once a week. Sometimes there might be no live stream that week. Sometimes there might be three live streams that week. I can't really um, I can't really say for certain. I'm actually starting a new job in a few weeks' time. Uh, so that's going to change the thing. So I don't want to say, oh, guarantee two live streams a week and then I start my new job. I don't have time for that. So I'm going to aim for once a week. I'll try and give you guys as much notice as possible when I'm going to live stream. I'll put a post on uh, Facebook, Twitter, YouTube and just say, hey, tonight at this time I'll be live streaming. And as I say, if you can't tune in, if you miss it, the video will still be uploaded as a separate video after the fact. So you can still uh, watch Days Gone if you miss the live stream. Yeah. That, I think, was everything I needed to cover with Days Gone. I feel like I'm forgetting something. I literally had a thought pop into my mind while I was talking, and then it disappeared again. Story of my life. That happens all the time. I'm going to remember when I'm editing, and it's going to bug me. If I remember, I'll put it on the screen. I'll, I'll write it down. Prepare for, like, a wall of text coming in front of my face when I finally remember. Yeah. I think that was that. Yeah. Okay, then. Next on the agenda. Uh, Batman Arkham episodes. I said weeks ago that I was going to get them recorded, and I did. But then Days Gone came out and I completely forgot about it. They've just been sitting on my hard drive ready. Six full episodes ready to go. All I need to do is upload them, but I completely forgot about them. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have those six Arkham episodes take Days Gone in place. So once Days Gone catches up and I start live streaming that, uh, I'll just start interjecting the Batman episodes every other day, just like Spider-Man. Kind of like it is at the moment, but just replace Days Gone with the Batman Arkham episodes. I don't know why I spread that out so much. My my brain, I think, is starting to foul, and it's only 1 p.m. in the afternoon. That's a shame. <laughs> so it looks like it's going to be an early night for the captain. But with that being said, the uh, last thing I wanted to talk about was Skyrim. With the uh, the changes I'm making to day, Days Gone and the Batman Arkham stuff uh, finished recorded and getting that uploaded, I should finally have time to um, play some Skyrim and get some of that recorded. No schedule as to when and where that's going to be coming out. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to aim for longer videos, but probably about once a week, kind of like with the Days Gone live streams. Um, and then, as I said, with Days Gone, I'll just evaluate it later on, see if we can get more episodes out. If I get a backlog of content, maybe we'll get two Skyrim episodes a week. But as of right now, I'm thinking anywhere between like a 40 minute to an hour long episode of Skyrim and just aim for it once a week. Kind of like a TV show in a sense. I mean, the way I format it, it kind of like is a TV um, is a TV show, but I feel like something like Skyrim works better with uh, longer episodes. I think I said this a few years ago. I think this was a change I was thinking of making uh, back before I got ill and um, left the channel from um, from before. But Skyrim's such a long game, you kind of need longer episodes to really actually have a decent amount of stuff happen in an episode. So yeah, no uh, time schedule on that. Um, it, as I said, once I start live streaming, days gone. Um, I'll have a bit more time on my hands. It frees up so much editing time having it um, live streamed. So I should have a bit more time to get some Skyrim recorded. But yeah, I'll update you guys when um, when I actually know when Skyrim is actually officially coming back. Yeah, I think that was everything I wanted to talk about. I don't think there was anything else I needed to mention. I'm sure I forgot a thousand and one things and I'm going to be really frustrated with myself um, when I'm editing this. Oh, uh, Captain's Quarters. Last Captain's Quarters was... The 20th of April, so yeah, next weekend. Next weekend, either the, the 18th or the 19th, the Saturday or the Sunday. Next weekend will be the next uh, next episode of The Captain's Quarters. So if you haven't watched the last one or you've got any questions you want to ask me, go to the previous episode of The Captain's Quarters. I'm sure I'm going to have a card pop up on the screen. I don't know if it's left or right, one of the two. I don't know where my hand's pointing. Um, yeah, there'll be links in the description, a card up on the screen, or you can just uh, scroll through my videos. Go to my last episode of my Captain's Quarters. Leave me any questions you want answered, and I just might answer it in the next Captain's Quarters. Who knows? Only one way to find out. But yeah, I think that's everything I wanted to talk about. 
I'm going to go get some editing done. I'm getting really behind on my editing. I definitely need to go get some editing done. I'm going to say editing one more time. Editing. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I, I, hope you're, I hope you guys are doing well. You're always really nice to me. So I hope whatever it is you, uh, you're doing in life, whatever it is you enjoy, I, 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 hope it's, I hope it's flourishing. I hope it's doing really good. Work's important. School's important. But most importantly, you should be having fun. Rule to live your life by that is. But yeah, failing that, hope you all have a lovely day. Be nice to people. And I'll catch you guys later.